I'm Paul Belisario, Assistant Global Coordinator of the International Indigenous Peoples Movement for Self-Determination and Liberation. We are Indigenous Peoples Movement based in the Global South here in the Philippines. The climate change, climate imperialism impacts indigenous peoples, communities, rural communities on how they live every day. It impacts on the kinds of disaster that they experience, the landslides, the many degradation of their ancestral lands, and even the way and how they produce their food, and how they exercise their culture, and how they live and exercise their spirituality and their ways of life. The many causes of the climate change that we experience today, the degradation of our environment, the exploitation and plunder of natural resources, all this is faced mainly by indigenous peoples as many development projects, destructive projects enter their lives, their communities, and their ancestral lands. Our message to the Canadian federal government, our message to the Canadian peoples, for them to extend their solidarity and unity with indigenous peoples and rural communities, for them to recognize their role in protecting our environment, in protecting our planet, and for them to realize and stand and defend their roles in combating climate change by recognizing their rights, by recognizing their ancestral land, we are making our way, we are making our move to protect and stop climate change.